Good I job. called it from the second we were starting this. I was like, I guarantee you, Jake has the most FUD set up on the planet. The Technoclip hurts. We've all made some poor gun purchasing poor. decisions. And today we are here to help you, America, from making some of these same mistakes by showing you the best gun collection that you can build for a modest $2,000. Now we're here at Gallantons in downtown Salt Lake. Thanks to those dudes for letting us come in and rummage through their Big space bank. today. And the rules of the game are gonna be simple. We've got 30 minutes on the clock for each of us to go build from what's available, the best gun collection you can build for a newbie, someone who's starting from scratch. So accessories best, included. Accessories included okay. minus ammo. We're not okay. gonna factor in tax, but it's the best collection you can build for two grand. At the end of which we will present that collection to a random stranger, and they will have to vote who did it best. The winner, bunch of glory. Oh, okay. the, the loser <laughs> is a loser. Ridiculed on the internet forever. Now, before we get into that, we do want to thank the sponsor for today's video. That would be Segura. You the will belts. notice, you guys, you, you know, you think probably we're just hawking belts. No, this is how I carry every day. Freaking yep. light inner Velcro belt with my Nighthawk, you know, whatever the treasure uh, yep. in there, right? So couple different belts you can use. Emissary, got the Battle Wagon. There's codes, 1911 Syndicate. You plug that in, no spaces. Plug that in, saves you 10% off. Great belts, we think you guys will like them. On with the freaking show. <laughs> 30 minutes on the clock starts. Now, you stupid son of a bitch. <laughs> no, you can go that way. Stop following me. I'm picking out guns Fuck first. Fuck out of here. I need to know go over there. Fucking two thousand dollars. Two thousand dollars is not a lot. Can I go behind the rope? Can I rummage around? Dude, this is like flashbacks to when I used to work behind the gun counter, man. I'm having like PTSD right now. This is for a new, a new shooter. Everything I like is like five thousand dollars per gun. <laughs> General strategy, we're getting a primary weapon, a secondary weapon, some accessories. You're gonna be kitted out either way. Here we go. I can already tell you what that stupid guy's gonna do. He's 100% gonna pick a Glock. It's not even debatable. He's gonna pick a Glock because he's predictable. He's a predictable white guy. I'm gonna give you a little bit of flair. PDP. I think a PDP might be it. That's a good pickup right there. Get, get away from me. I told you to get, you're the one following me, you asshole. Hey, but how about go somewhere else? Here's the thing about a VP9, 790. With a VP9, someone feels like they're getting German excellence for not a lot more money than a Glock. It's more unique, it's more ambidextrous because he doesn't know if he's buying guns for a righty or a lefty. He has no clue. He's, he's doing an AR and a Glock, like it's not debatable. I know what he's gonna do. I didn't even ask him because I already knew. AK, I mean an AK. I'm gonna win someone over with an AK. It might be risky, but you know what? Risk favors the bold, or the bold favors the risky. I don't know, it's something like that. It's a Modelo commercial. It's whatever the Modelo slogan is. Dude, that ginger motherfucker doesn't stand a chance. Not even a chance. So, what do you got? Like 700 and below. Do you got anything, you know, like backdoor special? Yeah, we got these Rigors right now for how much? Like 480 right now. 480? So definitely getting in that 700 and below budget. Glock 19, so you got any? Yeah, I guess you over yeah. there. We over there? take care of you okay. over there. I mean, I see one on the shelf up there. Is what's, what's going on with that one? So obviously, we can all figure out why we're going with this, right? Number one most reliable pistol probably ever produced. So here's the, the thing. You've got to start with the main staples. What are you doing? So I will be going AK in the classic 47, so 762 by 39. So I gotta do some budgeting here. I'm at 1784. Okay, look, I don't need a sling for this. It's an AK. You don't need to sling an AK. It's not a big deal. I need a holster. I need a holster. I need some HK Max. I'm not factoring in range gear, like eyes and ears. Nah, here's the thing. You don't really need to clean either of those guns, so. You need to get out of here, Jake. No, I, I'm gonna tell the audience what you're doing. Giant flaw in his strategy, because right now he's gotta buy optics. They're getting an optic. Again, all of it well, well under budget with quality gear. So I don't think Jake stands a chance. He's probably gonna say that you need a light because it's a combat weapon. AK, you don't need none of that. <laughs> Forget it, you guys get it. I need some mags. 10 minutes in. Yeah, I got 20 minutes left, son. I got time to spare. Where are mags at? Oh, here we go. 
I'll make you cry in front of everyone, Jake. Yeah, wait till a patron just absolutely rips your boring, predictable plan to shreds. Please. We gotta factor in accessories, right? So, we gotta have enough magazines for this individual to be able to train. Jake is probably going over budget. I already know it, so. It's gonna be like a step above the FUD good enough to actually like quality gear. Okay, so a little bit of a bummer. So VP9 very well priced. HK mags are not the most economical. So unfortunately the backup two mags that I'm gonna need are gonna cost me 44 bucks a piece. And that one kind of stinks. Under a thousand dollars, a complete legit rifle setup. So I'm at 1873. I literally don't even know that I need anything else. I'm just gonna go find something cool. You don't even need it. I got you everything you need for 1873. I'm just gonna go find you something that's a blast. What would be the cheapest firearm that possibly exists in this store right now? I have $127 to spend. Copying, copying me, I guarantee oh, you. Oh, you, you, you're actually smart enough to know that's not true. We got some money to blow. This guy's gonna get hooked up. Jake's gonna do that. Yeah, he's adding a knife. I'm a man of the people. I'm gonna beat you up if you don't tell me. Is he? No. <laughs> you need to. You need to leave, sir. Oh. oh. I'm not sure that he even picked a gun that can take a red dot, like a pistol with a dot. That's the primary. The AK is a benefit, just if the world ends. Every day, with your pistol. Just need a red dot on that. I also don't have a holster though. I wonder if they have holsters here. Do we have any generic holsters that fit everything? I think we made it sound like dollars. Safari. Like Five dollar bin, where would that be? Oh, I see that bin and I like it. If Tim sees this, I'm so sorry, Tim, but. He's gonna get destroyed. It's okay. Might be able to make a holster out of this. You could sew your own holster. You do a lot with $5 in that. Sling for your AK. Genius and all of you at home know that that is the most genius sling solution you have ever seen. I can't do public math, get out of here. Well, that's what I'm saying, man. This is the bargain bin. Like you want to you want to really load up here. My, I would buy that, but my gun won't fit in it. Could this be a holster? I think it's a knee pad. <laughs> yeah, it's a knee pad, it's not a holster. <laughs> it's true, because you're gonna have to take a knee when you shoot in the apocalypse. I'm earmarking these things because I really like these. I'm sorry, Tim. You told us not to ruin anything. A question? Do you know if if the mod deuce is $127 or less? Would would this fall within a price bracket of $127? Live and learn, I guess. Yep. How much time do we got, Jake? I mean, because we got the budget, we're going surefire. DC, right? Every good warfighter should have one of those. If the guy doesn't choose me, He's an idiot. Plus I have America's rifle. He's going com block, I guarantee it. And I got the rifle for cheaper than sticker. So we're getting the rifle for 450. Um, he's getting plenty of mags. Do you mind if I squeeze right in front of you for yeah. one moment? I'm currently in a competition. I'm trying to budget out my purchases that I'm making. That's, you know, I'm not gonna look back from that. That's a... Well, kinda, sorta, yeah. <laughs> Buying it with like Monopoly money that doesn't exist. Okay, so we're at 1800. So you have to? I say you should. Okay, cool. I'll do that. The rest, the rest is all mags. So he's going to be set on mags. $93. I made the rule that you have to spend the whole 2000 You can't give the person cash. No problem. I don't want to give them cash. I want to give them all the value that they bargained for. Oh, what the hell is this? Has anyone ever heard of Sousa Optics that can vouch, vouch for this? 149 That's $150. Bucks. Well, I've got to go on the tag because I'm a man of honor. Uh, I'm going by tag price because right now we're not in Cancun, Mexico, where I come in and you're like, it's $150. And I'm like, I'll give you a 60. And then you're like, oh, I'll give you 83. Fine. Take it because that's dirty. And I'm not going to do that. This costs $5. I will gladly give you $5 on my budget for this one knee pad. What kind of man with bargain that counts? A dirty one. Is there any favors I can do to you to make a, a little bit lower? One that has doesn't support small business. Let's game this a little bit. Right? One that doesn't even like the 2A community. If you did that, it's because you... It's basically like going, oh, hey, nice store. Thanks for having us in. Can you give me a deal on everything? That's the equivalent of what that man would be. So I've got 90, uh, $93 in the budget currently. Oh! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that is, oh, it's for a Glock 43. The Techna clip was gonna be the holster for the VP9. Shit, it's for a Glock. I bet you could modify this though. You could modify this. You guys ever seen those commercials with, uh, you know, you see them on like Fox News for the like Gorilla Glue 
Just glue this on the back of your slide. This is a score. This is five. I'm proud of that. I'm proud of this one. That's five dollars. <laughs> okay, five minute warning. We are getting down to the wire here. How much time? Oh shit, five minutes. Um, Dude, I'm, I'm doing very well right now. I think I've covered all bases, but there's one more thing that I want to cover. Let's go this way. Ear Pro. I got to find Ear Pro in like five minutes, so. We have some foamies up the front. Front? We're going back this way. Got to give that guy credit. Sorry, man, excuse me. This is going to be the last, last icing on the cake. We're good to go. Oh good. my God, the ass whooping you were about to receive. Oh, my friend. please. Now he's gonna start piping up when he knows he's gonna lose. Cause you lack imagination. I've got $77. So we're doing last math check here, but I think we're, think we're good. I think Chris is done because he didn't think through a plan. He has no inspiration behind what he's doing. I'm just gonna get some extra 8K max, man. You need more time? You need time extension, Jake? No, there's like a minute and a half left. You sure? Yeah, why don't you chill out? A $20 knife. Fuck it. Yeah, it's a yes. I got $23 left with something just awesome here. That's $23. Another AK mag. That's what's awesome. Don't even know who makes that thing. That about wraps it up with uh, 25 seconds on the old ticker. So I'm just going to hang out and just kind of relax for 25 seconds, you know? Just marvel in what it is that I have assembled here. Six, five, four, three, two, one. So I'll start. Gentlemen, go first, right? Um, I think I'm a clear winner. There's not even like a question on it. My guy's getting hooked up with literally anything and everything he could ever want to start his firearms journey. Except for imagination and wonder. Those are the two things he's not gonna receive. He's gonna receive zero creativity. Oh really? I guarantee it. But what if he receives 100% practicality? I think Do people you know are more practical. Overrated practicality is? Oh really? Yes, huh. 100%. <laughs> Guys, you were gonna see the ass whooping oh, of a lifetime coming up right now. Well, but before we do that, you guys go to 1911syndicate.com. Uh, check us out if you need real estate help. Let us know. Um, we pretty much service the whole country at that point. We got Patreon. Sign up for the newsletter on the site. I would suggest you do that so you get yep. inside sneak peek to product releases and you know different things. Go educate yourself. Sure. I promise it's good for you. You'll be glad you did it. I guess let's go find some sucker to present this stuff to. Okay, so here's how this is going to work. Yep. Um, a possible three rounds, a guaranteed two rounds. Okay. We will have two minutes of peace. So you're gonna have two minutes to present your case. You can go first, that's fine. Yeah. No, I was gonna let you. No, yeah. I think you should go first, you're bigger. Um, Stupid. And then I will go uh, second, and then we'll do round two, two minutes, two minutes. At that point, if we deem we both agree to the terms of a lightning round, you will have an extra 60 seconds on the lightning round. Are, are you wanting the extra 60 seconds because you think you're going to need it? or No, it depends how it goes. We have to agree to it, so we'll figure that out in a moment. Suspect. I'm the number one Beretta salesman in the state of Utah. Not confirmed. All right, Jake. Uh, round one. We're going to set a timer. We got two minutes on the clock, right? Just Four. so the camera sees. Ready? You guys ready? Yep. And... Let's go. Liam, how are you, man? Good, how are you? You having a good day? Thanks for stopping in. Dude, thanks for your time today. So you seem like a man that likes to compete, mm. to be practical, sure. to maybe save a couple bucks on gear and guns. Oh, right? that sounds like I see you're like a big me. Beretta fan. Oh, right? that's right. Nice to know. Uh -huh. I hear you're uh, the number one Beretta salesman in Utah. Uh, unconfirmed, but cool. it's probably true. Well, we're not going to talk about Berettas today. Okay. But what we are going to talk about is a $2,000 budget we have to kit you out in case you had no guns whatsoever. Okay. Newbie, right? So... Clock 19. Oh my God, this is so shocking. Gen 3. Oh, okay. For a couple reasons, reliability. Right. Ease of use. Sure. Cleaning, parts, aftermarket support. But to get you started on your firearms journey, this is a pistol you can shoot competitions with, you can go to training classes with, and you can concealed carry, right? We're coming in at a uh, 5.10 for that, that bad boy. How many Ooh. bags? So, comes with two bags. Okay. So plenty enough to, to train with, right? Is that it? So, we're gonna get into your long gun next, right? Okay. okay. So we got a Ruger here, chambered in 5.56223, America's rifle. Is you are you American? Uh, mostly. So you support American? Uh, definitely. Okay, my man. So this is a good rifle. Here, you can hold okay. that. Test it out Beretta for you. Okay. And is that a sports Italian to me? They have a U.S. factory. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So this, so, yeah. Shut your damn mouth. How oh, about that? That's a two-stage trigger. It is. How, how do you like it? I think that's a great rifle. Right? Eighteen-inch okay. barrel. Okay. Okay. So pretty then, long, pretty long then so then we're gonna barrel. need to uh, be able to see, right? So I got you a nice optic here, red dot and magnifier. Okay. From Sig, reputable. Very okay. good. So we'll we'll cut out your rifle there. We also you gotta have a way to carry it, right? Sure. So we've got a sling for you. One of the best slings on the market, right? Oh, Vickers. So you, you got it. You, you familiar? I think I've seen them. We need another way to carry your 
your pistol, right? Okay. And we're gonna need a way to carry ammunition. So I found you a great holster that comes with a mag pouch combo here. Nice. Inside the waistband, CCW, as well as mag pouches, CCW. I don't think that okay. mag pouch can be very so. secure. Um, well, it goes through belt loops and it, oh, oh we're good. Hard out. Shut it down. Hard out. Man, that is the worst sound ever. All right, it's my turn. Two minutes on the clock on round one for me begins. Now, my friend, Chris, to your big, big goofy looking guy over there, mm -hmm. is a freaking fool, okay? Let me tell you what you would be looking for in a primary. A gun that requires zero maintenance whatsoever. Zero maintenance. Okay. To the extent, where do you think you put an optic on this? Uh, nowhere. Do you need one? I don't know. Not nah, really though, because okay. you know what this has? Built in to it, you can adjust the iron sight so I could shoot a person at two miles. So this is a combat weapon. It has a side folding miles, stock, just a little stiff, so I'm not gonna waste time on that right now. Doesn't but you could, you could fold this so that you could put this in a bag if you needed to or something like this. Excellent, this is from Riley Defense, by the way. Excellent company, my friend. I have thought highly of them for years. Um, the wood is a touch of, you know, it's just classy. It's just freaking classy. But the AK, the AK really speaks for itself. But what you're gonna need to know, this comes with one mag. I have purchased an extra five mags for you. The reason I have done this, so you have six total mags. You have three that you're gonna do when you go to the range, right? And you're like laying it down on steel targets and shit like that. And then for when the apocalypse pops off, you grab your clean three, and these are what you actually rock and roll with when you go shoot zombies, okay? Oh, that's smart, smart. So separate mags for training, which he probably didn't think of because he's not really that bright. Um, so, um, one thing that I'm also gonna highlight, I got this as an accessory for the AK. This is a knee pad. So if you need to take okay. a knee while you're okay. shooting, okay, sense. you would drop to one knee. This is your knee pad. Chris is gonna you talk to you. Else those are good for? Thank you, sir. Performing fellatio on people. Okay, uh, look, oh. Chris is gonna talk <laughs> to you about Vicker slings and all that kind of shit. You know what's cheaper and better than that? A freaking roll of rope. Sling this bad boy up. Mm. That is your sling, my friend. Like, that's it. You're looking at your sling right there. This, this is five dollars. This Passable. is also from Passable. Browning. This is from Browning, right? So it is reputable rope, mm. okay? Get that out of here. Get this, get all this out of here. Right there. Terrible, terrible choice. Oh, that's off to a good start and you know it is I can problem. tell Liam is already disappointed in your decisions. We're gonna have to see performance. Chris Blau, shocker. Picked a AR and a Glock, everyone. Boy, that is freaking shocking news for America. <laughs> now, what is such a bummer is it looks like you oh, only have worries. two magazines for your oh, pistol. It's your primary weapon that you actually fight with. You have two magazines. Huh, I believe those are called sidearms and a primary weapon would be considered a rifle. I'm on the streets of downtown Salt Lake right now. You ain't carrying that. that that's not the scenario, is it? This is the scenario. Listen, listen, you, you bitch. Dropped the ball again. Oh you gosh, dropped the ball again. here we go. go. Ahead, take your two here minutes. we go. I'm fine with it. Two minutes on the clock, right? We got it, Liam, see? Ready? See? and starting. So, we've gone over the firearms, the way that you're gonna carry the firearms. We need to get into a little bit more of the accessories, okay? So, I am a proponent of having training mags and fighting mags, okay? So fighting mags, we went with capacity, right? This is a P-mag rounders. Oh, the okay. big stick? Yeah, big stick. I okay. can appreciate that. And then also, if you wanna get real saucy, like our boy Mike Pannone, we got the uh, Surefire round mag, okay? Get How much was that? Now. It's in my budget. That's how much it is. You're right. You're right. <laughs> he dropped $150 of his budget on one magazine. And then I think I got one, two, three. Here, can you, Jake, hold those for oh, me? Here you go, hold those. Same? Let's see, for, what is that? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, so we got six other mags. Now these mags are gonna be for training, or if you didn't wanna use the tall boys, we could always sneak one or two of these over here. The thing is you have options. You can have your training set up. You can mix some training stuff in with your duty stuff. How are you gonna carry these? However you choose. How do you okay. carry these? Now, do you wear pants ever? Uh, typically. Do they usually have pockets? Uh, most of the time. Question answered. Not very Next. secure though, not very secure Now usually, quiet. When I'm running, when I fight, not very Usually secure. when you're shooting, especially if it's a high round count, you're fighting zombies, bad guys, you know, you burn the whole 60 rounds, your hands are gonna go a little hot. Right. Right, so I, I wanted to keep you safe. Thank you. Okay? Always wear protection. Unnecessary. Another thing I got you is enough foamies to last you a lifetime. Which will also expire because they're gonna get okay. dirtied and crudded up with earwax and shit like that. Next thing, done. maintenance is a big thing, right? We wanna keep that boar clean. I got not you a boar snake. Not. Okay, got you a boar snake. Some some finer weapons need a little bit more maintenance, much like a Ferrari. Okay, or right? Beretta. Or, yeah, yeah, see, there you go. 
Another big thing is your your ojos or eyes. Okay, got to protect those. Got and it. last but not least, you're in a dark situation. You need some light. We got you a cloud, fence, rain, mount everything. All you need to illuminate yourself. That's literally okay. like three hundred dollars it got spent on a flashlight, my friend. So I, I don't know about you, but that's like a. We're done. Good. And my round two with two minutes on the clock starts now. All right. Let me tell you everything wrong with Glocks. Predictable, boring, and you righty or lefty? Ready. Okay, so let's just say, so we got a friend named Mike Pannone, okay? He lost one of his eyes, and what happened was he had to learn how to shoot his left-handed shooter. The benefit of this is it's completely ambidextrous firearm. Also really cool is if you're out in the streets, I'll lock this back since we're in a okay. gun store. Okay, okay, you lose on Oh, principle. 100%, I'll spend principle. 790, I would've given you $1,500 for this, son. Oh my okay, gosh. so if you're ambidextrous, right, I can drop max here, I can drop so max ridiculous. here, I can drop my slide on either direction all freaking day. I've also got good Good nighttime sights because you know where most of my fighting happens in darkness, my friend. Okay, statistically, Legit. that's not true. And, if, it, and if I ever want to up my budget, I can take this little plate off. I put a little red dot on it. It's a freaking party. And you're probably wondering how do you carry this, or you're probably wondering how about this? Do I need any more mags for it? So it comes with two. Those are the two that I recommend you. You know, you train with and everything. I was willing to spend some budget, forty-four dollars a piece on an extra two mags. These are the ones that you party with when things get heated. Okay. okay. So you save these. Just leave them in the wrappers. How are you gonna carry it? This right here, this is called a Technoclip. Now, the this most one, unsafe form absolutely of not. Carry absolutely on the not. Okay. Now, here's the thing. This one is is for a Glock 43. Okay. So, so you, you didn't will, even get you the right one. You're not listening though. God. It screws into the back of a Glock 43 slide, but you wouldn't want to do a Glock 43. You want to do a VP9. So what you do, don't worry about the screws. We're gonna get you some super glue, and you're just gonna glue this on the back of your slide. Oh, okay. Okay. You're gonna bet your life on super glue? That's a little it's ghetto. It's like gorilla tape. Oh, it's but, a little ghetto. I don't like, think you use that. Word with mine. This will 100% work. This is a technical it's high end stuff, okay? Um, also, this, if you're gonna wanna carry this in your vehicle, I got you this so that you can mount your pistol underneath your Fun. dashboard, okay? <laughs> Freaking genius. Fun. Also, hey, if you really need to party, get some work done. Cause Time's up. <laughs> Good knife. Good I night. called it from the second we were starting this. I was like, I guarantee you, Jake has the most FUD set up on the planet. Are you kidding me? I want to look at I want the, a lightning round. The Technoclip hurts. Oh, no, no, the, the, the <laughs> no, we're not at a stage of feedback. This isn't the feedback <laughs> moment. The Technoclip is should just end it there. The te Technoclip is fine. You just made up the choice. You lost <laughs> and the truth is you don't even need the Technoclip. You just throw it in your, in your belt. Oh, felony carry. Now, felony uh, carry. Wouldn't worry mm -hmm. about it. Right? Do you ever want children? Uh, then do Israeli carry. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, so Israeli carry, which statistically shows you will die quicker. No. Okay. I don't think those stats are real. It's uh, fake news. I mean, Israel doesn't lie, so. Well, I think we should do a lightning round because I have a couple other things that I would like to discuss. I think, I think instead of us deciding, because I think there's a clear winner, we should let Liam decide. You do would want to hear more information than less. Do you need another minute from him? Let's be real. I haven't even uh, shown you yeah, There's yet. a couple more items I'd like to some explanations of. Yeah, but he couldn't even get through round. his presentation a lot of He time, already made so up his giving him a handicap. Don't, don't try to bully him. Let's do a lightning oh. round. All right, one minute. One minute, here we go, start. So I think after the end of our presentations, Liam, it's pretty clear that you're an American. You support American ideals. Sure. It's you like American-made products, an Austrian pistol, though. right? Now, he does have a point there. Originally, this was made in Austria. Serial number-wise, that is one that was produced in the States in Smyrna, Georgia. Okay, okay. I can appreciate so, that. Yeah, serial number-wise, the numbers line up. So, um, anything, no, no, okay. Another thing, you know, because I knew that you really liked Beretta. Thank you. I wanted to make this personal. So I got you Beretta shooting glasses. I heard those right. are uh, 3A rated. They are, okay, yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. And really, I, I guess I didn't really need this minute. I'm just letting you know this is a great option. Covers all your bases. It's American made for the most part. This is America's rifle. I, I really don't think I need to present my case anymore other than just make the right choice. We'll see. I'm, I mean, that's, oh, I'm also $9 under budget. So I saved you nine bucks. That's lunch. So. My man. Where are you having lunch? Pizza shop. Right. So we're gonna head into my lightning round. 
which will be the round that I like to think of as an absolute spanking for you. Huh. <clears throat> Watch I, and learn, my friend. I didn't friend. think it was necessary. Timer starts now. All right, I've uh, Lima pretty much shown you everything, but you do need to protect your ears. Unlike the stupid orange foamies that he gave you that you're gonna, one, you're gonna lose because they're tiny, two, they're gonna get dirty because they're foam. Uh, these last forever, they run on a thing called battery. Actually, no, these are not battery powered. So Using there's actually, there's no electronics Using needed on, on these. So like in the, hey, if there's an EMP strike, you know what still works? Your ear pro, okay? Next thing. It's grasp and it's frost here, guys. So this is a magazine carrier, okay? From so where, 1910? You're, you're gonna what are you, throw this, Jones? You're gonna throw this on <laughs> your belt. <laughs> you're gonna throw this on your I'm belt. I'm sorry, he's disrespectful. It does take AK Max, okay? Does so, that look efficient? Does that? <laughs> two AK Max okay. on your belt. You got your sling, you got your AK. Here's the deal. Here's how I wanna really wrap this up, because I think of us as friends, which is there's two paths that you can go down in life. One involves originality, Remember creativity, the Taliban uses all this. being a man okay. of the people, and you know who likes German engineering? Everyone. <laughs> I hate you. So get, give us some thoughts here. Okay. You've seen two really different paths. I think that's fair to say. Um, and I mean, I don't know, buddy. What do you think? I don't know. There's a, definitely a big fork, you know, we okay. came to yes. with these choices. Uh, Communism and freedom. Yeah. Okay. Uh, different levels of... Uh, I wouldn't say yeah. Of, uh, you agree <laughs> to that pretty quickly. <laughs> so uh, there's some things I'm concerned about, you know, uh, the like. Technoclip. Is a big one for me. That hurts. Ooh. You don't have to use uh, it. I don't. I want to carry my gun, uh, preferably in a holster. That's oh. just me. Huh. Uh, but I do really like the uh, the kind of the spare mags going on here. The mag yep. carrier for the belt. Yes. Because uh, I want to carry rifle ammo. Yeah. That's important to me. This is your primary. So Back we already talked question. about it. Pants are not secured. This ain't going nowhere. Look at that. And I, I do like the handgun choice for the uh, this set. The VP9 optics ready. That's pretty Gucci. Pretty Gucci. Even though I it's like going to shoot your dick off. Like <laughs> no, it is really carry Jeez. that thing. I thought I liked you. Uh, and I do like spare pistol mags because I think uh, you are going to be carrying the pistol. Dude, I got four mags for you. Four. So that's that's good. Uh, at the same time, we're getting magnification on the AR over there, uh, which is kind not of not only important. magnification. A sighting system. It does we live have a in a sighting system. We live in an urban environment down here, though, where distance is really not an issue. That sounds like a lawsuit and felony to me. Hmm. I'm trying to protect you, sir. You got to hit what you're aiming at. Yeah. So agreed. These are known to be the most accurate platforms in the world. I think I read that somewhere. Yes. <laughs> in the Soviet Union's papers of <laughs> when they made it. That's correct. <laughs> So it's what about not, the knee pad? Like, don't, don't you really think this is just kind of some? You don't have to use no. it. So he wasted your money to buy you something you're not. It was five dollars. It's in five dollar bin. Guess what you could have got for five dollars? Nothing that? else. More max. Oh. No, you couldn't. Okay. Rest my case. So okay, uh, you know, where are we at here? Do we got a winner here? I'm, yeah, give us your thoughts. I don't need to hear his. Stupid yeah. So thoughts. for the biggest thing that I like about this, this is really important because you you know you carry your handgun every day, so you do want a holster. That's a big selling point for me. I oh. agree. That's uh, on I got top the clip. of that. Just having this. It just strikes me. I love these. Uh, having some more rounds and the magnifier, of course, right with the dot combo. Um, it's it's tough. It's tight. It's not looking Ooh. good for you. Dude. It's tight. Uh, real sling is cool too. Yeah. What do, do you like do, what do you mean real? <laughs> it's not made out of rope. It's a, it's nylon. It's good. <laughs> it's but good they're vickers. both. But they're both nylon. You can do a lot of other things Probably. with rope. You ever seen any Indiana Jones? Okay. I guess it goes with the stupid leather mag pouch holder thing. Yeah. I, I, but again, so I have all these magazines here, but I don't have any way to carry them. Oh my, my goodness, pockets. that's kind of a problem, so, though, ain't it? Pockets, uh, man. But this is this is super important to me too, having a weapon light. Yeah. That's how, nice. How come? Especially since he said a lot of fighting is done at night. So I mean, well, it is it is dark half the time. Okay. Uh, like, not so half, having some not kind half. of light. Okay. Fifty percent. It's not fifty percent of the time I, though. I, I also don't recall any eye protection of any sort down there. That seems typical for an AK owner. And if you remember, like, you know, daytime, nighttime, kind clear of lenses, Beretta. Sure, sure. I don't know, just just helping you, just pointing some good things out. You already own some oh, sunglasses, though? Hot hands, you know. So I mean, I, think, uh, uh, huh. I have my mind so made up. So, me. Oh. Well, he made up his mind after, again, coming back here. So, I would probably... I think I actually know how this is going to go, but you go ahead and say it. Yeah. So, I think, uh, overall... 
if I had to recommend this to, to somebody or myself, um, this is probably gonna be the loadout. Wow. So, Any specific nice reasons job. or? Uh, I mean, the big thing was uh, just how well set up the, the rifle is with the magnification, the light, and then I have a holster for my carry gun, although I do prefer the HK. Um, I mean, just the kind of the taste, the tasteful accessories is what made it for me. You know, tasteful. it's more of a complete setup. Oh, yeah. All right. tasteful and complete. I, I get described that way often, so yeah. <laughs> That's hard to believe, but yeah, yeah. your choices are good. <laughs> you think you're pretty funny, don't you? Coming onto my show, doing this. Coming into my store. <laughs> oh, Liam <laughs> with the shots, bro. <laughs> You know what? You got anything else you'd like to say, Jake? Yeah, suck it, Liam. Oh! Maybe I won't come back to the store. I think it's time we hear from each of the contestants individually. So a recap of what happened today is a guy that tries to befriend everyone, and that's what I could see him doing. I didn't want to call it, but it was a dirty play. The whole time I'm out shopping and trying to find guns and accessories for the people of America, he's out there hamming it up with Liam, trying to make best buddies trying to do whatever he wants to do to him. So it was a dirty strategy and it was a predictable strategy. I knew exactly what he was gonna pick, which is why I told you guys in advance, he's gonna do a Glock and an AR. Like this is not gonna be shocking. I went with a wise strategy, one that backfired a little bit, but that's because Liam, I think got schmoozed by a big jolly green giant. And next thing you know, here I am stuck in the freaking corner where they relegated me. So I guess let's hear from the winner. So real quick, you didn't see the competition, did you? That we just did? No. Who do you think won? Probably me, right? Yeah, I did win. Reason why is practical, American. I don't know if I need to say any more than that. Also safety, we had hands taken care of, eyes taken care of, ears taken care of. And one last time, the kit that Jake chose is what we like to call in the gun industry, especially gun stores, FUDs. People who like to buy FUD weapons. So, our boy Liam is not a FUD, he chose the right choice. Thanks Liam, you're the man. Now, say you had to use any of these firearms in a self-defense scenario, FLP has you covered. FLP is really self-defense insurance, whether you are a CCW guy, as I am currently, or home defense, or vehicle, or walk on the streets and things yeah. get crazy, Fisticuffs. whatever it is. If you're in a legally justified uh, shooting or self-defense scenario in general, they will cover all your attorney fees. Um, there's an attorney hotline, because you know who I don't need to talk to when I just got in a shooting? A customer service rep. I don't need to talk to them right now. Correct. It's like, no, 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 sir, can you please give me the attorney? That's who I actually need to talk to in this yeah. moment. So they will do that. So they've got the body cleanup service. They don't call it the body cleanup up service but they do it is a body cleanup yeah. service um and anyway there's code it's 1911 you plug it in saves you like a third off the uh off the different subs, not subscriptions but memberships there um and they got family plans and all yada 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 you know if your kids are running around strapped whatever um so check that out thanks for you guys let us know if you like this video if we if you guys have good feedback we'll do it again and uh next time uh you know it's gonna be an ass whooping yeah and it's also you know july 13th so if you see another video like this we did it first what do the YouTube thing. What was the, what what? Are we at right now? Put the hand over the lens, the oh, YouTube thing. Just now? Oh, I don't know.